Hezbollah pager explosions, latest, device attacks in Lebanon kill 32 as Israel declares new phase of war. Lebanon is reeling after 32 people have now been killed in two days of device explosions across Beirut and other cities. Handheld walkie-talkie radios used by armed group Hezbollah detonated across Lebanon south on Wednesday, stoking tensions after similar explosions of the group's pagers the day before. Lebanon's health ministry said 20 people were killed and more than 450 injured in the second attack in Beirut suburbs and the Bukha Valley, while the death toll from the explosions the previous day rose to 12, including two children, with nearly 3,000 injured. Israeli officials have not commented on the blasts but security sources said Israel's spy agency Mossad was responsible. We are opening a new phase in the war. It requires courage, determination and perseverance from us, Israeli Defense Minister Yov Gallant said, adding that his country's military focus is shifting to its northern border. Wednesday marked Lebanon's deadliest day since cross-border fighting erupted between Hezbollah and Israel nearly a year ago, heightening fears of an escalation into a full-blown regional war. The Iran-backed militant group has vowed retaliation after the operations appeared to throw them into disarray.